Hey everyone, it's Sarah, and I am here with my weeks six and seven for my Project Life album. And I've been kind of struggling to keep up, <laughs> so, um, sorry, Layla hit my camera there. Um, when our family came, you know, I didn't do anything while they were here, and then when they left, I wanted to just do layouts. I didn't want to work on Project Life, so <laughs> um, I kind of have been focusing on that more than anything, so I'm still kind of playing catch up a little bit, but I did get these two weeks done, so I wanted to go ahead and post them. Uh, so for week six, um, both of these weeks are going to be just one page, and I... We just haven't been super busy since we have moved to New Mexico, which I'm actually kind of enjoying. Um, <laughs> um, so I haven't had too many um, two-week or um, two-page spreads for one week. I think that week eight will be, though. Um, when Josh's dad was here, we went to the circus and did a bunch of stuff. So um, I think week eight is going to have two pages for one week. But these two are just one each. So for week six, I have laid out my pictures, and I only have three printed, and um, I'm going to do a little bit of journaling. And then one card is just going to be a decorative card because I really didn't have um, much to, I didn't have like any other pictures or any other stories I wanted to tell that week. So um, I'm kind of just laying my stuff down here. I pulled a couple cards from the Midnight Edition of Project Life, which is uh, what my base is. And um, I'm just going to go ahead and get some stuff stuck down here. So for my title, um, I'm using these pink paisley uh, letters and numbers. And um, those I got in uh, one of my hip kits. And um, I really like them a lot. And I pulled out what I needed uh, for these when I decided I wanted to use them for this week. And so I pulled out the W, the K, and the 6, and then I pulled out a 1 and a 2 as well because um, Brody down there on the bottom, he turned 12 that week. So um, I'm going to use those to document that. And I'm rounding my corners here for things that I need to round. And I just used some scrap paper for uh, this card for Brody. And I used pink, and I, I didn't have like a specific reason. I'm using a lot of pink though so far this year so I need to I need to work on some other colors I'm kind of noticing a lot of pink is going on um, but those scraps I just had sitting on my desk when I sat down so that's what I'm using um, so I used the number 12 there and then I'm going to use these black thickers and I'm gonna spell out Brody and I didn't have an O so I took a Q and just cut the little tail off of it to make an O And I see Layla sitting there with me as well. <laughs> um, so I have a couple of these um, puffy stickers that I'm going to use. I actually think I'm going to end up using all of these between these two spreads. I used those up. And those came in a hip kit as well. Those are from Dear Lizzie from her serendipity line. Um, I just had my, my old hip kit stuff sitting open on my desk because I was working on a layout. And then I decided to work on this. And so since it was just sitting there, I was like, you know what? I'm just going to use this stuff <laughs> So that's literally what I did. Um, so this card right here, that is a thank you card that I got from a friend of mine for a baby shower gift that I got her. And I really like the card. So I'm going to just stick that there. Um, for the bottom there where my hands are, um, that's a picture of Kaylin and Josh's mom. And um, that was the week that she came to visit. And after we picked her up from the airport, we went to Panda Express for lunch. And she was showing Kaylin how to use chopsticks. It was really cute. Um, and I kept uh, the chopstick um, paper that holds them, so it says Panda Express, so I just cut that down. Um, so for my decorative card there, I used a cork piece that says Our Life, and then just a uh, piece of scrap paper that has pink and yellow polka dots on it. And for this one, I'm going to do some journaling on it, and I just put a vellum frame from Studio Calico around it. And I pulled out those um, asterisk stickers from Freckled Fawn. I'm going to use a few of those as well. Okay, so uh, I have the John Wick picture there, and that's a movie. Josh and I watched that movie at home one night. Um, and then, and I really liked it. So if you guys like good action, there's a lot of killing, but a uh, really good action movie, and Keanu Reeves is just proving himself to be 
a badass. Uh, but that's a really good movie if you haven't seen it yet. <laughs> okay, so for this one, I used a puppy sticker there that says hooray, and I'm documenting that Walking Dead came back that week. They came back from their winter break, and that is hands down me and Josh's favorite uh, television show. So we were excited that that came back on. Um, I didn't print out a picture for it, so I'm just doing what I can. I didn't feel like printing out a picture, so. <laughs> and I'm just going to use a little piece of washi tape here that's sitting on my desk as well. I'm just trying to keep it simple this year. I'm not trying to overdo anything or overthink it. I'm just doing what I feel like doing at the time. Um, so I'm taking my tiny tetra and I'm going to staple this frame down uh, since it is vellum. I'm doing two staples on each side, I think. Or maybe I just do one on the top. Um, and this one, I'm actually documenting that I spent a lot of time that week applying for scrapbooking design teams. Um, a lot of blogs and companies were having um, calls for new design teams, so I kind of kept up on them and um, started applying to ones that I wanted to be a part of. So I spent a lot of time that week doing that. And here I'm documenting uh, that Josh's mom came into town and that we had lunch and she was teaching Kaylin how to use chopsticks. It lasted a whole like two minutes and then Kaylin's like, I'm just going to use my fork. <laughs> so <laughs> it was funny. And I'm going to use um, these pink asterisks. I think I'm going to use all of them up. I'm going to use that little scallop banner up there. And I'm just going to spread some of these asterisks around. I believe I use up all the pink ones. Yeah. And um, on top of the Brody picture there, I have that little chevron overlay. That's from the Project Life overlay pack. And that was week six. And now I'm on to week seven here. So week seven, um, I have a few pictures. Not a ton, but I have a few things here. This was also Valentine's week. So... Um, I'm gonna be documenting that as well. So I have the, I have my pictures and my stuff down where I want it to go, and now I'm just choosing cards that I need to uh, back things. And then um, for the three, four by six ones, I'm actually going to use some of this pattern paper. And I'm just trying to figure out which ones I want to use here. I'm still trying to work my way through some of these papers here. And I'm using more pink again. And I mainly for that because um, the Valentines that Kaylin picked out for her class are pink and then um, her PJs in that picture are pink and the big flower that actually came on a gift that um, Josh's mom got for her for her birthday. We kept that flower there and that's pink as well. So, um, Speaking of that, I'm going to go ahead and get this put down on my card and that came, you know, I, that was from her gift. So um, when I when I tore off the um, her tag right there, <laughs> the flower came off too. So I thought, oh, that'd be cute to put on. So I kept that as well. Um, so I'm rounding all my corners of everything here that I need to, and start working on stuff. Uh, this is a little letter that my dad sent to me. He um, he sent us a check for Christmas, actually, and we just got it. Um, he just sent us a, a gift card um, for a restaurant for a Christmas gift. Um, and it was just, it was a little late, but it was fine. Like, we even told him he didn't have to do it, but he wanted to, so. I just kept the note that he put in there with it. Um, and then on the bottom, Josh and I were able to sneak out while his mom was here and go see American Sniper. So I printed out a movie poster of that and had our tickets up there. And, um, that movie, oh my goodness, I'll talk about it in a second. Um, <laughs> but, uh, so then I have Kaylin's Valentine's. I'm not going to back it with anything. Um, it fills up almost the whole space, so I'm just going to leave it there. Um, and then the card next to that, I have stickers that came with her Valentine's as well that I kept. And then the one on the bottom is a card that Josh um, gave me with some flowers that he got me for Valentine's Day, and it was a little typed up letter. Okay, so uh, doing all my journaling here and just talking about, um, you know, Kaylin's Valentine's. Those are the ones that she chose and she came home with a lot from her class. Um, the picture of Kaylin in her PJs, her, uh, Josh's mom, that was her birthday gift. Um, PJs for her and the matching PJs for her American Girl doll. So I took a picture of those. 
Okay, so American Sniper. Oh my goodness, you guys. Oh, that movie. Um, I am a big Chris Kyle fan in general before the movie even came out. And I read I read the book, American Sniper, and I loved it. Um, and I've always just been an admirer of his. And then the movie came out, so we realized Josh's mom was going to be here while it was still in theater. So we snuck out and saw it. And we both just kind of left a little bit speechless. <laughs> um, even me, like even though I'd read the book and I know what happens, it was still just completely moving. And Bradley Cooper, oh my goodness. Ooh, he was good. Um, but it was, it was very moving. It touched us for sure. Um, okay, so I'm using up some stuff here. So I used up those puffy stickers and I'm using up the dark blue asterisk here. And I'm going to use one of these little um, puffy banner stickers from Freckled Fawn as well. I'm just trying to, I'm looking around my desk and seeing what I can stick on here, literally. <laughs> and that's it. So um, nice and simple, kept everything, um, you know, just used what was close to me on my desk, literally. It went pretty quickly. Uh, so here's a bunch of close-ups for you. If you guys have any questions, let me know, and I'll be happy to answer them. And I'm going to work on catching up with some more Project Life here. Okay, I will see you guys again soon. Thanks. Bye.